People are losing money selling on Amazon FBA. If you are a beginner Amazon seller, or maybe you are someone that has thought about starting your own Amazon FBA business, this video is for you because I'm going to share with you everything you need to avoid so you don't end up losing thousands of dollars. will risk losing money selling on Amazon FBA if you don't follow the five things that I am about to share with you in this video. I started my Amazon FBA business in 2018. I've made multiple seven figures doing this and I also mentored thousands of people just like you how to become successful in their Amazon FBA businesses. So I may know a thing or two that you don't know. Myself and other Amazon sellers have already made these costly mistakes but I will share with you all this information for free so hopefully you can fast track your way to success. All I ask is for you to subscribe to my channel and give this video a huge thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm. Let's get started. So if you don't want to lose money selling on Amazon FBA, then the first thing you should not do at all costs is to launch more than one product at a time. I always see new Amazon sellers getting super excited about making a bunch of money on Amazon and they launch two products, three products, four products, even up to 10 products. And I'm here thinking, what are you doing? You are doing it all wrong. Let me explain. Let's pretend that I am opening up a coffee shop. I have one coffee shop that I want to open. Now, before I open my second location or my third location, I should probably see how customers react to the coffee and my desserts at my coffee shop. I need to know if I'm making any profits. I need to know if my customers like my coffee. I need to know if I have the funds before I start opening a second coffee shop. So the same thing applies when you are selling your products on Amazon. You should launch one product at a time because you need to invest money into inventory and then you need to invest some money into advertising to get your product to page one. You need to invest money and make sure everything is going smoothly before you launch your second coffee shop, before you launch your second or third product on Amazon or else you will be spending a bunch of money with no return. If this is your very first product, then I highly recommend you to stay away from launching a second or third product until you start making a few thousand dollars in profits every single month. This way you know that you are profiting before you start a new product and you will have the funds to start that product without worrying about more expenses. It is never a smart choice to launch more products when you don't even know how your first product is performing. We need to make sure that customers love your product and that you have improved it to a point where people are just raving about your product and you're making a bunch of money from it before starting something else. Number two, people are losing money selling on Amazon FBA because their product that they are selling is not different. It has no additional value and it's not differentiated from their competitors. Let me explain. So a lot of new beginner Amazon sellers, they think that changing the color or the size of an existing product on Amazon is enough to differentiate their product and to stand out from the competition. But that is so far from the truth. If you are someone that is only differentiating color or size, then people are not going to buy your product. It does not scream, wow, that is a good product. Instead, it screams, I am a me too product. You are being a me too, meaning you are selling a product that is the same as existing products already on the marketplace. So if there are competitors that are already making a ton of money selling existing products and you come into Amazon selling your product and you only differentiated the size or the color, then customers will not buy your product because there's no additional value. When we sell our products on Amazon, it is so important to find out what the problem is. What problems do my customers have that needs to be solved? If you can answer those questions and you did the proper product research to find what the problem is and you can solve that problem for your customer, I promise you, you will make a ton of money selling your products on Amazon because everybody will tell their friends and family and do the advertising for you through word of mouth about your product. This is exactly what happened with my first winning product that I sold on Amazon. 
I barely did any PPC advertising because a lot of people loved my product and they started telling their friends and family. So it was like free advertising. If you guys are new to starting your Amazon FBA business and you need my help personally on how to find profitable products to sell, then I encourage you to get my free Amazon training in the YouTube description below. Click on the free training link. Enter your name, enter your email address, and watch the training to the end because you get to book a free one-on-one -on -one call with my team and we will walk you through the entire process, how I was able to find winning products over and over again to sell on Amazon. Number three, people are losing money selling on Amazon FBA because they are using air shipping for their products to be shipped to the Amazon FBA warehouse. So if you guys are familiar with Amazon FBA, you have to find a supplier on Alibaba.com to manufacture your products. And most of the time, your manufacturer is in China. So we need to ship the products from China all the way to the United States Amazon FB warehouse or whichever country you are selling in. Most of the time, beginners make the mistake to use air shipping for their Amazon FB products to be shipped. Air shipping costs so much money, you guys. I think it costs at least five times more compared to using sea shipping. And when you are using sea shipping, meaning your products are being transported by a boat, a very big boat, using a freight forwarder or your supplier, it's so much cheaper. When you guys are doing sea shipping, I suggest you guys to opt for the slow sea shipping lane. This means it takes about one to two weeks longer than using the fast sea shipping. Using the slow sea shipping takes a little more time, but it is so cheap that anyone can ship their products from China to the Amazon FBA warehouse in the United States. So stay away from air shipping at all costs. If you can, I would never use air shipping unless there is an emergency. Maybe you are trying to restock inventory super fast for Q4. For the holiday season, a lot of customers shop on Amazon and maybe you want to be in a rush to get your inventory into the warehouse to make a ton of money. That's probably the only time I will use air shipping if I were to be in a rush. So do yourselves a favor, save a ton of money by using slow sea shipping. Next, people are losing money selling on Amazon FBA because they are sourcing products for more than $4 per unit. Now, if you guys have a big budget, maybe you are a baller, you have a ton of money that you can spend, okay, maybe you can source a product that costs more than four bucks per unit. But for every beginner Amazon FBA seller, or maybe you are in your first year selling products on Amazon, I am in my fifth year selling products on Amazon and I never source a product that costs more than four bucks per unit. Now I purposely do this and I tell my students to do the same because I don't want to increase my risk. I don't want to spend a ton of money on inventory not knowing how it will turn out. Maybe after a few batches of inventory and I finally have my product the way that I want it 100% maybe I will invest a little more money for my next product after I make a profit for this product. But I will never spend $8 per unit or even $6 per unit for any product because that increases my risk. Now, obviously, if you have the right training and support and mentorship, you can become very successful even with products that cost more. But like I said, if you had a choice to lower your risk or to increase your risk, and to spend less money or to spend more money, I would always choose to spend less money if I can in my business. That way I can use additional money to launch more products, to get more training, to get more knowledge, and to keep up with all of the shenanigans in an Amazon FBA business. And lastly, number five, people are losing money selling on Amazon FBA because they are inconsistent. This is probably one of the most common things that I notice in new entrepreneurs. When you start a new business venture, you have to be consistent with it 100% of the time. It's kind of like losing weight. Imagine you want to lose 20 pounds or 30 pounds or whatever. It is so important that you are consistent with your workouts and with your diet. So I'm not saying that you need to starve yourself or go on some crazy hardcore diet for 24 hours of the day, but you need to be consistent with your exercise and diet if you want to lose weight. 
The same goes for business. If you want to see results, if you want to make a ton of money, if you want to become successful in your business, it is all up to you and nobody else to be consistent. So I always recommend to people, if you can block off some time every day, even if it's 30 minutes to one hour per day and be consistent in your Amazon FBA business, I promise you, you will make money. I don't care what other people say. You can have like the most shittiest product. You can have the wrong product. You can do all the things wrong. But if you are consistent at what you are doing and you are constantly learning and you are hungry for knowledge, then you will see a result. You probably will not become a millionaire tomorrow. I'm sorry to break it to you if that's what you were hoping for. But I promise you eventually, if you are consistent with everything that you are doing in your Amazon FBA business, you will see the result and you will eventually make some money. So if you are someone that struggles with being consistent, then I recommend you to write down everything that you need to do. I find that writing down things that you need to do very early on in the morning really helps you to stay on track. If you don't believe me, just give it a try. If you hate it, you don't have to do it. But I promise you, the more you are consistent, the more results you will see. I hope this video has helped you guys today to avoid making all of these costly mistakes and avoid doing all of the silly things that I talked about in this video. People can make a ton of money selling products on Amazon. We've seen it over and over again. People make six figures, five figures every month. But trust me, they don't do any of the things that I talked about in this video. If you guys have any questions or comments for me, then please drop it in the comment section below. If you want to get notified for every time I post a new YouTube video, then make sure you smash that notification bell so you can get notified every time I post a new video. I'll see you guys next time.